Hey, yo, is, is everything set for Amazon Live? Oh, no. I, I forgot. I can't do this show with Evie Mux. So I'm logging in now to set up the other software. But Evie Mux streams to Amazon. What? Evie Mux streams to Amazon now. That's right. Influencers can now stream to Amazon Live with Evie Mux. <laughs> this is an Evie Mux update alert. Amazon Live, in my definition, is a crowdsourced home shopping network where influencers share solutions to their audience's problems in the form of a live shopping experience. Ah, free! Amazon strictly accepts stream settings of 720p and 30 frames per second, settings that many streaming applications don't give users access to. I've got a plan though. I'm excited to share that not only has EVMux made this possible, they've created a specific option just for Amazon Live so you can set up quickly. Yes, let's go. Kirk Nugent here for EVMux, your live streaming sweet spot. And in this video, we'll look at streaming to Amazon Live with EVMux. So here we are in EV Mux, and we're going to go into one of the sessions to add a new destination. And for those that don't remember how to do that, this will be a brief refresher. So we go into sessions, just choose one of your sessions. Uh, we'll go into a studio. So we're going to go into studio for day two here. Day two, let's go into that studio. And that opens that up for us to be able to work with. These destinations will be here for anything that is under this project anything that's under this project. So in order to edit our destinations, we click on the edit icon up here at the top. This one says edit. We click on edit and we scroll down to the bottom of this dialog box that comes up and we select add destination, add destination. So once we have that, we can add a Facebook live. We can add LinkedIn. We can add YouTube, Twitch. We can add RTMP. But now we have this option to add Amazon Live. So we was gonna select that option and it opens up an Amazon Live dialog for us to input the server name and the stream key. Server name and the stream key. And in order for you to get that, we gotta go over to the Amazon Live Creator app. Let's do that right now. So here we are on my iPad looking at the Amazon Creator app and I've added one product to the carousel because that's required. I've just given it a quick name called Testing EV Mux, and I'm, I've selected external camera as my source, my video source. If I tap external camera, it gives me another dialog, and you can see that you can actually select phone camera, and then it also has the horizontal and vertical options, but external camera is what we want. And in order to get your URL and stream key, you would simply click this icon here and copy your URL and stream key so that you can paste that into your other app or send it to yourself so that you can get it on your other screen. We click here to click save. In order to do a test stream, I'm going to go into practice mode here on Amazon Live Creator app and say yes, turn on practice mode. Practice mode is on. You can see that red bar at the top, at the below my, my graphic there. And I'm going to leave this in preview. I'm going to leave this in preview. If all the settings are correct, when we set it up for EV Mux, then this button will light up red. Right now it's grayed out, but it'll light up red saying that we're ready to practice right now. So now let's head back over to EV Mux to input the stream URL and stream key. Now we've inputted the stream URL, the server, right? rtmp.live.amazon.com slash live. That's gonna be the same for everyone, but your stream key, however, is specific to your account. And I just wanna make a note right here to say, do not share your stream key with anyone, because if you do, they'll, they have the potential to be able to stream on your account. And that's the reason we're graying this part out, even though I just pasted that in and I'm going to click save. I am going to have that part grayed out so that the world can't stream on my Amazon live account. So now we've put in our server, we put in our stream key. I'm going to give it a name. And then we can click save. 
now that we have that saved, we can click here on edit. We can turn off any other streaming that we were pointing to and just stream directly to Amazon Live. So we have that there, we click save, and now we're ready to test this out. We're gonna click go live. And while that is going live, let's go back over to our iPad to see if this thing lights up. If this lights up, that means all the settings are right and we are ready to stream on Amazon Live. We're just gonna give it a few seconds for it to buffer, for it to get all of its stuff right. I can see that I'm live on my desktop here and we're just waiting for it to come up on the stream now a few moments later and so now it's there and it says practice now this button when this button is illuminated that means all of the settings everything is already done it's already correct it's already right the right uh stream size 720p the right frame rate 30 frames per second everything has been selected correctly for this to work and so that is how you would go live on your amazon influencer account for Amazon Live through EVMUX. Those who had to figure out all the settings by themselves to stream to Amazon Live will appreciate how simple and easy EVMUX has made this. I mean, it's literally four steps, y'all. <laughs> Edit destinations, add destination, select Amazon Live, input your server and stream key, then hit save. No frame rate or stream size to select, and it just works. That's the stuff. Now you have the power of EVMUX for your Amazon live show. Watch these videos to learn more of its features.